referee in charge for this bout is Mr. Chris Anderson. Firstly, to my right in the blue corner, trained by Jason Walker from the Massa Gymnasium. Hailing from the Gold Coast last night at the weigh and he weighed in at 72 kilograms. Tonight, he's wearing white shorts with black and red trim. He has a fight record of 16 fights, eight wins, one draw, four by way of knockout. Please welcome Brad Kangalang Small. <laughs> Trained by Om Uk from the Angkor Gunkumai Dojo. Last night at the weigh in, he weighed in at 72 kilograms. Hailing from Berry. Tonight, he's wearing mar maroon shorts with blue trim. He has a fight record of 10 fights, six wins, and one KO. Please welcome Ben Rowdy Milford. <laughs> Fighters to center stage, please. Okay, third man in centering, Chris Angry Anderson with the final instructions here. Let's listen in. The rules nice, nice and tidy. Protect yourself at all time. Listen to me at all time, okay? This full new tie. Now, knees, elbows, everyone goes, okay? Back to spin. Good luck, boys. Good luck. Okay, short and sweet Hold as always from Chris folks. Angry Anderson. Spin and we're ready to roll. Elbows are allowed. Muay Thai rules, knees and elbows, all the good stuff. R and J's ready. Chris Anderson saying everything goes. Headbutt hammer. For me, I'll be biting ears and noses. <laughs> but you said it Seconds out. Okay. Here we go. The voice Michael Chevello, the hammer Mark Castanini with you. Full Muay Thai rules. Rib kick there from Brad Small. Well, Small from the Gold Coast Massa Gym. And he locks on for the grapple early here to Small. He's been uh, doing some sparring with uh, Danny Maskechev in preparation for this bout, helping uh, Danny out. All the crew down in the Massa Gym on the Gold Coast. Nice rib kick there from Small. Oh, oh crossing elbow. The elbow flies early. First one of the fight to the jawline of Malford. And Chris Angry Anderson separates both men. Malford uh, really needs to hold his guard up a lot higher. The Kun Khmer team, Cambodian style in the corner of Ben Mountford, him and all the boys. Jason Hawker across the ring in the corner of Brad Small. See, so, uh, Small, if he chambers down that lead hand of Mountford and then rolls the elbow straight off it, so pull down an elbow, could have some success with that, especially seeing as Mountford's holding his lead hand so low. Small just setting himself for the rear leg round kick. Will he throw it? Well, Brad Small, again, another fighter built for, uh, for Muay Thai. Long arms and long legs. The elbows will fire at a good range if he lets them do so. But uh, you can take nothing away from Ben Mountford because uh, he's always uh, walking forward and having a real red-hot go. But a real step up in class taking on uh, Small. Good double round kick. Triple make it round three, kick. make it four. four. Go throw another one, son. Keep counting. Four in a row, Hammer. I like it to the left rib cage of Mountford. And look at the reddened marks around the ribs and the waist area of Mountford already. Oh. Big right hand he throws. Doesn't connect for him. All tied up. Right. Downward elbow from Mountford, but nothing behind it. Chris Anderson separates them. Oh, and a roundhouse right elbow on the bow. to finish at the end of the first. End of round one. Wow, what a cracking first round that was. Full Muay Thai rules. Now, Hammer, we've got word that our fighters for our main event are just rolling up outside. We're about to take a look as Danny Maskashev and Jason Trampson roll up here to the Sunshine Entertainment Centre for our main event, the Grudge Match. We've all been waiting for. Here they come now. And this, we have told is Maskashev. Fox Sports 3 at 8.30pm. Well, the, uh, the boys get out of the car and uh, have a look at Maskachev. He's looking very focused and uh, ready to do the job. You know what, he's been around forever, Maskachev, and this is just another day at the office for him. He's, uh, he's very comfortable stepping up in the main event uh, status and uh, certainly he's going to he's gonna test the young fella and uh, really out. make it something special. Liam, very relaxed indeed there, the legend killer, Danny Maskachev. All the way from Queensland, arriving here in sunshine. And doesn't he look calm and collected and ready for the main event here tonight against Jason Tramsek? We're round ready to two. rock and roll second round of this full Muay Thai rules action. First round unofficially, we are giving it the way of Brad Small. Clash of kicks there from both men. Rib kick from Small, right hand from Small to the jawline. 
Glancing left hand from Mountford. Walks into a double right hand, crossing elbow from Small. Well, the boy's now throwing the right, the right hand, both of them actually. Right cross, and then uh, re-chambering with the, uh, the right roundhouse elbow. Oh, a right round with the round kick, kick from Small. Downward elbow, look at the clavicle cracker, then to the top of the spine from Mountford. A little bit of a demonstration of why Muay Thai is just so brutal. Put the kids to bed, I say, Hammer. Put them well, to bed. Certainly, I'll tell you what, I saw uh, some at the, on the recent trip, world class uh, Muay Thai over in Kazakhstan. Hammer, you did a Borat style. Well, As a guest of the, the Prime Minister of Kazakhstan getting chauffeured around in the former military chopper. Well, that was uh, a lot more uh, than a funny movie, the old uh, Thai boxing Muay Thai Kazakh style. Did you wear your mankini over there, Hammer? <laughs> <laughs> and uh, Alex Daly, the demolition man, now the uh, the new world champion, 78 kilo weight division. WMC title was on the line and uh, the demolition man, Alex Daly, successful against his uh, Kazakh opponent. And what a war that was with uh, a star-studded lineup, fighters from Hong Kong, Scotland, and uh, Benny Ritter, my mate Benny Ritter was there from Switzerland. You love the all Benny Ritter, All taken on uh, the Kaz Kazakhstan's best. And of course, that was on the uh, the back end of uh, the uh, uh, international kickboxer annual uh, trip to Thailand to Koh Samui. My old mate Stefan Fox uh, hosting that. Nice so, uh, knee. Was, uh, I'm very Muay tired from uh, watching all the fights, <laughs> I can tell you. Bangkok, oh. Samui, and then over to Kazakhstan and Uzbekistan. So it was uh, a real entertaining trip. We've just returned to and uh, it's back to the lofty heights of sunshine <laughs> now and uh, some great fighting to finish that round in the, round two. In the second round and a great round there as in goes to work in the corner of ben mountford you still feel that mountford has some ground to cover though i've got him slightly trailing uh, i'll have to hammer. agree with you michael he certainly does we saw denny meskashev arriving only moments ago jason tramsek is also turned up here here it's comes tramsek main event tonight tramsek the terminator against the legend killer denny meskashev well, uh, Kevin Dennis sponsoring the cars, the beautiful cars. Kevin as they, uh, drop, off, drop off uh, the fighters. A little bit of I think he's uh, negotiating a deal on the car in there. <laughs> Seconds out. Oh, there he is, undefeated. Reinhard Bedardo, Bedardo in the back, in the back seat. seat. All the boys have come in together. And he looks focused, doesn't he? Young Jason Tramsek, 13 and 0 with 12 knockouts. Can he make it 14 and 0? Round three. Against Maskashev here tonight. Back in centering, third round. Full Muay Thai rules. We've got Brad Small in the white trunks ahead unofficially. Once again, they measure off. I think uh, Small. Fairly confident and uh, starting to find his groove, but uh, at the end of the last round, it was certainly uh, Mountford working the elbows on the inside. Right back, start again. Right back, good boy. Right. Jason Hawker shouting instructions in the corner of Brad Small. Start again. Right. Well, and Chris Anderson keeping the boys busy at range. If they're in the clinch and they're in the grapple, they've got to be uh, affecting some uh, some good control of the grapple and then bringing the knees up nicely underneath. Outside thigh kick from Small. Don't forget, folks, if you're surfing the internet, check us out on MySpace. The profile name is Fox Kickboxing. And if you want to join the official mailing list to receive all of our broadcast updates, email foxkickboxing at gmail.com. Foxkickboxing at gmail.com. Nice right hand there from Small. All tied up like a pretzel. Angry Anderson separates both men. Nice jab there from Mountford, oh, spinning back elbow. Back Nicely done, but off target from Small. <laughs> Mountford really needs to get a move on with things here, Hammer. Well, he certainly does. He's, he's uh, almost counterfighting. He's waiting for, uh, for Small to, to launch the combo and then firing back off it. But you know what? Sometimes it's too late. The points have been landed. And the damage has been done. You've got to be first to the punch. Come on, start back. Start again, boys. Final seconds here. And there it is. We get in the round three. three. Once again, I'm Probably feeling the by Brad Small is in control of this fight. This is 
how it went down. Again, Small just initiating all the attacks, using his height and reach advantage nicely. And uh, he's really not put a lot of elbow craft into it. He's uh, now working the range and doing it nicely. Spinning back fist, let fly. So Chris Anderson gets us underway. And final round. Final round. And it hasn't been the barn-burning fight we'd hoped for. And Ben Mountford now has two minutes remaining to turn this fight around. Well, Victoria versus Queensland. And at this point, it is the Queenslander ahead on the scorecards, we'd have to say. Rib kick there from Small. Just gets his distance with that lead hand. Nice high guard. He's all Muay Thai, Brad Small. Switches up off the lead. Tries for a crossing elbow to his Mountford. Bit of dancing with the stars over in the neutral corner. Knees to the rib cage. And Chris Angry Anderson keeps it nice and clean. Oh, the right cross landing to the jaw of Mountford. Good rib kick there from Small in the white trunks. Outside thigh kick from Small. Tries the overhand elbow. Now cameraman also copying an elbow through the lens <laughs> almost. Hammer. He's in the action. Back. He's in the action. He's in the thick of it over there. <laughs> any more, any more in it and uh, he'd be copping a punch himself. Oh, nice right hand. Doubles up on it then does Small. Walks him back against the ropes. Jason Hawker getting a chance to lend some instruction in that blue corner. Final seconds tick down here on the final round. And Mountford just hasn't done enough. He hasn't taken the initiative. He hasn't thrown down here with Small. Looking to uh, launch the right round elbow. Small, but uh, Mountford keeping the, the guard up nice and high. Well aware of the damage that can be done. The right cross. Small comes forward, spinning oh, elbow. It's about time, spinning man. elbow. To the land, and there's the overhand elbow. Oh, Mountford, last attack for him. He's mounting one final fight. The end of the fight. Two rounds of applause for both fighters. I dare say, Hammer, Brad Small and is going to take the decision. The traffic Diversion Group and Corgi's Auto Spares, please. Well, the traffic uh, division group and Hawkeye's Auto Spare sponsoring this one. It's going to go to the man on screen, Small, from Queensland. Here's how it went down. Mountford a little on the back foot. And uh, Small just working constantly on the forward attack, landing some good scoring technique always. And uh, nice, clean movement and uh, also bringing uh, his kicks and punches and knees into the right zone to land the points and uh, put it well and truly on the judges' scorecards. The spinning elbow was the best thing that uh, Benny Mountford did in that round, but unfortunately not enough. Ladies and gentlemen, your winner, unanimous points decision from the blue corner, Brad Small! Got about it, Brad Small from Queensland takes the victory. He's a stablemate of Danny Maskashev and does that auger for things to come later tonight in our main event. Maskashev and Tramsek, and look at the crowd. We are sold out at the Sunshine Entertainment Centre. 1,500 hot hands. Not a spare seat in the house. It's great to see Melbourne kickboxing back on 